Cancer. This is Elijah from Wisdom Seekers for mid-May to the end of May 2018. Just a few words about what's happening in the energy. Let's see what's going to happen with us or you this next little while. First of all, we'll choose a card. This one. And so it's Seek the Truth. That's pretty impressive. It's beautiful, actually. And that's what we're all doing right now, isn't it? Anybody who is in the spiritual path or interested in what's happening in the energies, they are right at this moment seeking the truth, more so than at any other time in any of our lifetimes. Now well, let's see what the energy, how that goes for other people. Or how it goes with, with not other people so much as uh, with more, more information. How, what can you say? More information is always good. So... Well, so far, the good in information is, it's good energy. This is the sun card, and I call it my candy cotton joy card. And to me, seeking the truth is a spiritual journey. And true spirituality is very joyful or joyous. So that is in, in the, that's what is happening right now. You are becoming joyful. And you are supported along the way, the Knight of Cups. And uh, the Knight of Cups is he's holding the Holy Grail. And that was supposed to be, I think, in the King Arthur legends, the Holy Grail was the symbol of reaching enlightenment. And so the card of the Knight of Cups is a card of support, it's a card of strength being added, and it's a card of change or shifting. Um, when you grab this card, or you get this card, quite often it means that the energy is calmer, or you have support to help it be calmer. So far the cards are pretty fabulous, Cancer. I read the Lovers. And again, that's a very spiritual card. And it has been the tradition over the eons of time that the woman brings the man to spirituality. And it is through the woman that the man develops or learns about true spirituality. Once the man learns about true spirituality, then he grows extremely fast and, and as a general rule, is a bit of a skyrocket. But then he turns around and helps the female rise up to his level. So it's all very, very positive, all very, very spiritual. Let's see. So far we've got three major arcana. We bought the Empress. The Empress is abundance in all forms, fecundity, with your looking to... Uh, reproduce and um, but it's it's abundance in all aspects of your life not just not just the grains in the field and the money in the bank but here you see her foot is on the moon that's a sign of spirituality and the, it's a female sign but that's also a balance of the male female energy as well so should we try for one more or should we just leave it because they're such good cards well i'm going to try for one more and we've got the king of wands and the king of wands as a man is very he's a very wise man he's as you can see with the dragon around him he's also very he's he's very comfortable in life and he's, uh, he sits and he watches a lot. So if it's a man, there's a man in your life 
who does this, he watches, will only help when asked. But if you don't ask, he won't help. But uh, once you push him, he will help. <laughs> Otherwise, it's it's wisdom. It's it's and the energy of wisdom is is coming a part of your life right now. And um, as we can see, you're seeking the truth, and you're finding it joyful. You're supported while you do it. You have the love of growth, of becoming more, which is creating a form of abundance for you and you're seeking more and more wisdom or your wisdom is not you're not seeking it so much as it's appearing for you which which is very positive because we know everything we know everything in our um, in in the universe we just don't know we know it and our bodies are not genetically capable of holding the whole truth but with we go beyond our bodies to the bigger part of who we are we know everything so what this card the last card i pulled is release and generally what we need to release is the idea that we are not perfect release the idea that we are limited and here on earth yes we appear to be limited but with if we can release that, with if we can go beyond that, we are not in the least bit limited. We can do anything. The, what the superheroes do on TV in the physical world, no, it's not possible. But in the spiritual world, we can do all those things and more. So seek the truth. And the truth is that you need to release all ideas. And you're completely, completely supported this, this next little well. So please, Cancer, just really enjoy yourself because the cards are awesome. And I'm going to say goodbye now. Namaste. Namaskar.